welcome you here today as we come together and celebrate the remarkable achievements of our underclassmen. I want to extend a warm welcome to our students, their families, and our dedicated staff, and all of our esteemed guests. Your presence here today highlights the importance of this occasion and shows your unwavering support to our young scholars. Today we gather on in the hard work, perseverance, and academic excellence of our underclassmen. This ceremony is a testament to their dedication and commitment each of these students have shown throughout the school year. It is also a reflection on the strong support system provided by their families and encouragement from our dedicated teachers and staff. Thank you. As we recognize the, the accomplishments of our students, let us also celebrate the journey they have undertaken and the growth they have experienced this year. Today is a day of pride and joy, a day to acknowledge their hard work and look forward to their bright futures that lie ahead. Without further ado, it is my pleasure to inter introduce our voted school counselor, Ms. Bearden, who will begin announcing the recipients of this year's underclassmen awards. Please join me in giving a warm and friendly welcome to Ms. Bearden. <laughs> Good afternoon. We start every year of the Underclassmen Award with the Book Award. These are awards that are given by colleges throughout the country to recognize juniors, not just for the work that they have done their junior year, but the work that they have done since entering Gravy Junior Senior High School. So I start with the Smith College Book Award. It's presented to a junior of academic standing, character, and promise. This year it goes to Cassandra Flaherty. Outstanding Achievement in Leadership and Academics, this year's recipient, Cole Fuller. This year's recipient, Shaylin Hochschild. The Bausch and Law Honorary Science Award for Outstanding Achievement in Superior Intellect, promised in the field of science, Cassandra Flaherty. Alexis Lapeet. <laughs> the St. Michael College Book Award for students in the junior class who exhibit achievement in academics and community service. Gavin Kennedy and Margaret Crawford. The Suffolk University Book Award for academic achievement and the forethought to acknowledge diversity in our global society, Nathan Benson. The Endicott College 
College Book Award for a student with strong leadership skills and an interest in the science field, Tristan Mo. An Ivy League Award from Dartmouth College for the student with high academic achievement, acknowledgement of diversity, and strong leadership, Cameron Blank. And finally, our highest book award from an Ivy League school, the Harvard Book Award, presented to a junior who is in the top percent, five percent of the class with high character, high level achievement through extracurricular activities and leadership, strong character and promise, and true academic standing, Austin Smith. <laughs> These next awards are for students in honor sections for all our excellence in writing, critical reading, subject interest, participation, and positive attitude. English Nine Honors, Merrick Barcos, and Brenda Marino. AP Seminar, Braden Gallagher, Braden LaDuke, Mylan La Liberty, Faith Ramos, Stephen Slovic.
that at all. Okay, here we go. For, for students in, with the highest average in grade nine, may, math honors Barry Bartos and Brenna Marino. <laughs> Grade 10 math honors, Caitlin Curran, Scarlett the Rose, Faith Rollins. <laughs> Grade 11 math honors, Gavin Kennedy. Grade 11 Math AP, Cameron Lohan. For the student with the highest average in grade 9 math, Nathan Walsh. Grade 10 math, Benjamin French. <laughs> Grade 11 math, Aiden Beach, Cheyenne Laramie, and Ava McFarland. Please join me. Other students recognized for their academic achievement, work ethic, and positive attitude in class activities. AP U.S. History, Cole Fuller. Lydia Pike. <laughs> U.S. History Honors, Emma Boyer, Caitlin Curran, Benjamin French, Brayden LaDuke, and Mylan LaLiberty. Are recognized for excellence in 
academic scholarship, aptitude, and determination to succeed. For Biology 1 Honor, Brenna Marino. For Biology 1, Lyle Bergeron and James Duca. For Anatomy and Physiology Honors, Cassandra Clarity and Cole Fuller. Yeah. And for Anatomy and Physiology, Cameron Lamont. Environmental Science, Autumn Seagard. <laughs> Chemistry One Honors, Cameron Lamont. Thank <laughs> you. 
Alright, so Ms. Jordan is going to cover the wellness department. Consistent excellence in all aspects of the class and demonstrates the highest level of sportsmanship, effort, and attitude. For the ninth grade wellness, Brennan Anderson, Cindy Shukhanov, Chris Pergario, Tessie Healy, Ty Jones, Audrey Fleisch, Eleanor Slovic, and Nathan Walsh. Thank <laughs> you. 
For painting and drawing, Margaret Crawford and Olivia Redmond. And for Art Foundation 2, Celine Zamonte and Mason Walsh. The Computer Science and Technology Department, based on work ethic, class participation, and the understanding of the computer science principles involved in the class. For AP Computer Science Principal, Quinn Fuller and Maxwell Kennedy. Based on attitude, work ethic, and understanding of the AutoCAD commands and functions, for the CAD course, Brennan Anderson and Meredith Barcos. Based on attitude, work ethic, attention to detail and understanding GIMP and publisher commands and functions, for graphics, Shaylin Hostile. Based on work ethic, class discussions, and showing an understanding of basic computer science principles, the award for exploring computer science goes to Cassandra Flaherty, Brenna Marino, and Paige Ramos. And the award for 3D printing goes to Quinn LaVoy. In closing, I'd like to extend my sincere appreciation to our teachers for their selections, as well as the guidance staff, who include our two school counselors, Ms. Bearden and Mr. Cipolletta, as well as Ms. Justin, for their hard work behind the scenes putting, today, putting together today's ceremony. Congratulations, and I wish you all, well, let's talk about this. So it's almost the end of the school day. So I just want to say have a great rest of the day. So if you choose to dismiss your students that we have here, um, please stop at the main office. So congratulations again, students. May not have a great rest of the day. Thank <laughs> you.